You are watching a Devil TV with the Lenovo IdeaPad S205 RAM upgrade and hard drive upgrade. As you can see here, we have uh, already uh, some screws lying out here. That's because you have to take out 15 screws and it will take a little bit too long to show you this with taking them all out while shooting the video. So all you need to do is take the battery out first and then start um, taking out um, the screws right here on the bottom. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So there's 3 here and 4 on each side. And then you need to open the device up and then you will be able to take out this keyboard pretty easily. As you can see here the three screws holding it in. You took them out before and then all you need to do is just take a hard plastic card you don't need anymore, go in here, lift that up and it's pretty easy. You don't need to take it out all the way with the cable like I did. You can just leave it like this and then there's another one, two, three, four screws which says one to um, M to X5 here that you have to take out. After you did that, it should be pretty easy to just go around with a card around the whole device and take off the bottom. Um, I did that of course too. And now you can see here the bottom yeah, it's off and here it's here is what's inside the device itself. This was till now. Um, 15 screws. Now if you want to take out the hard drive you need to unscrew at least this one and that one and watch out for this wireless LAN cable here. So you have to yeah, dismantle that all the way. You can check out all the pictures on endevil.com in a higher resolution of course. So um, you have two slots here for the DDR3 RAM um, to take one of them out or two of them out. You should make sure that it's always and that they have always the same size to make it work faster and after um, 4 gigabytes you need a Windows 7 Home Premium so all you need to do is push these metal arms to the side then it pops out a little bit like this and then you can just take them out and as you can maybe read here as I already said it's DDR3 sodium RAM this has 1333 MHz and this is a 2 gig stick so there's 2 times 2 gigabytes built in here when putting it back in make sure it's the right way and push it all the way down till you don't see the golden legs anymore like this and then just push it down and that's actually it for upgrading your RAM as I already said a maximum of 8 gigabytes DDR3 sodium are supported so putting the device back together pretty easy it's the same thing just put back on the plastic bottom um, put back in all the screws and from the keyboard side the same thing. Thank you very much for watching Endeavor TV. This was the Lenovo IdeaPad S205 um, hard drive and RAM upgrade tutorial. Um, tune in again.